Hello dear friends, this video is, uh, is just to, um, with the subject of uh, a piece of cake. The cake name is uh, Gato Chocolat au Zamond. Yes, it's a cake of chocolate and uh, almond, almond meal and there is no flour. And uh, I want to take this chance, since I am here with this piece of cake, I want to he take this chance to explain how I take a photo. So, <clears throat> in the camera there are many settings and uh, it can be quite complicated and intimidating to go to all these details. It usually takes one month, two months, or even longer to get used to a new camera. And we are, I am still learning about it. And one thing I realized, now you can hear the g -g 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 sound, that's the camera, so super sensitive. One thing very important is to make sure your hand is not shaking. The camera now, the digital camera, they are very, um, they are very smart. They can, they can um, detect the object you want to, you want to shoot. So, <clears throat> so when you, your hand is staying in a certain place, and uh, the camera slowly think, okay, this is a place wants to shoot. This person, the owner wants to shoot, then it fix and zoom in. And the digital camera is usually by color contrast. Sometimes good digital camera does not need to have very bright light. It needs enough color contrast. What here I made a sample example is there is too much color contrast. And the chocolate is dark chocolate, so it's very dark. And uh, the cream is white. So the color contrast so much. And uh, the camera automatically get uh, um, attracted by the bright object, by the light object. So it ignores the black part. So if you put your camera lens here, you almost do not see anything about the cake, right? If you want to see the cake, try to put, to ignore the white and uh, let the black parts show off so it will see. And it's by color contrast, so it, uh, it shows very much of, uh, of the subject you are going to shoot. And um, what I am doing right now is macro. So, uh, as a suggestion in all the camera, digital, cam digital camera, there is an auto setting. So put into the auto setting and slowly zoom in until you find the image is good. Now I move it. It takes some time for the image to go to be good. After some time, it is good. So the, the digital camera at the beginning is kind of blind. It's, uh, it's, uh, it's, it's kind of lost way looking for, for the, looking for its way home. So if you always targeting in one place, the digital camera can understand what you are thinking and finally find. See, it finds. And uh, Another thing is about uh, the background. Uh, it depends on how much area you want to take picture. For example, this one. I want to take picture only this big. So a light, little tiny piece of, uh, of napkin is good enough. So you do not need to make your whole house like uh, a palace to take a tiny picture. It depends on how much space you will need. So this um, napkin has um, this napkin has red color, 
and our family just by chance had some red rose falling off so it has red and red so there is color white here white here so uh, there is uh, a harmony and there is um, is color matching and not too much sudden if this place come out a green or um, a blue it might be too much of a sudden it's too much of a con contrast for example this one you feel the color comes out of nowhere try to avoid this and um, we have white yellow red pink uh, black there are a lot of color already but they are usually all of the same color family if there is only white red and pink the color looks a little bit too too shallow and you need some black to to really get the the whole picture settled down and um, what else yes and because uh, the first picture I used a white plate to take picture of the cake but the white with dark cake too much contrast so there is um, I cannot even detect the black cake the dark cake so you use a black background then maybe I put too much of this sugar and you use a white background that uh, a black background then the cake can show up let's see this one can be even better because you get rid of uh, some of the white so not too much trick in it uh, make enough con color contrast but not too much do not try to avoid extreme color contrast and um, put your hand steady and fix to one object may it be far away or macro close zoom in until you find the right image the right clearance clarity take the picture okay thank you very much you can hear the, the lens zoom in zoom out Enjoy and you endure. 